Hi guys, welcome back to another cooking and eating episode. This might be a one or a three part video, it depends. And uh, today we are going to be making pasta with meat, minced meat and tomato sauce. So I have here my minced meat already. Minced meat. Then I have here two tin cans with uh, tomato sauce and we have tomato pieces in it as well. And then we need olive oil here to bake the meat. I have my spices here. We have a chili spice and a Paprika spice. Then we have here piment, which I have to uh, cut a little bit or chop up maybe. And here I have some white pepper and garlic powder. And here I have seasons of the province. That means season of the province means the province where the seasoning is made. There is all types of seasoning in here. I won't mention which types of seasonings are in there. What else do I have here? We also have here some, some parsley, which we are going to be using, and we have caraway seed, I think it's what it's called. Caraway seed. And we have our pasta, pasta here, 500 grams. We're not going to be using all of, them, all of them because we're not going to be eating that much. So let's get started. So first thing first, put that to 12, heat the pan up. Then we're going to put in the olive oil because we have to bake our meat. And we're going to be using our trusty spatula. Uh, this is going to be a two part because we are also going to be making another eating video. Like I did yesterday. Eating dinner and sitting in front of the camera and doing a chat. So this is going to be a two part on cooking first and then eating. So we are going to put in the meat now because the pan is hot. And it's going down the heat here. So I'll stop the video here and when it is all baked we're going to be adding this seasoning. 
So now this evening, I'm going to start with the paprika here. I'm going to add in some parsley here. Then it's empty. Garlic powder. Some more pepper here. Seasoning of the province. Caraway seed. What else do we have here? We have our piment. We're going to be adding, adding the piment as well. So the piment here and we're going to be adding in some grill master seasoning as well. So let's give that a stir. And we also need to add in some salt as well. That looks nice and spicy so far. So now we are going to be adding in our tomato sauce. And I turn up the heat again. I'm gonna rinse this guy with water. So as you guys can see, I have added in the tomatoes. We might have to add in a couple more tomato. Tin tomato, that other tin can with the tomato sauce in it. Might have to add in some more of that. Okay, let's put in the water. So we get the sauce. And I'm gonna put that to 12 so it will cook. And we also have to fill that pot up with water so we can start cooking the pasta because that will, that will take time also. Alright, let's add in the rest of that water. And I will pause the video and I will be back when we are going to be doing the pasta here. And that is coming up to the boil quite good already. What I want to do is, I want to also add in tomato paste. That is tomato paste for the tomato sauce there, so I'm going to be adding that in as well. Because that is almost the main ingredient for tomato sauce. So let's add in the, the tomato paste a little bit. I'm not going to be adding in all of it.
All right, that is the tomato paste in there for making tomato sauce. So let's give that another stir. Never forget the tomato paste in, when making tomato sauce. Alright, we are gonna fill this pot up here with water. So, we are gonna turn it on and put the lid on. And that is coming up pretty boil quite good. So we have turned on the pot with water here. So we're gonna put in some salt here. And we're gonna put in some salt here as well, not too much. Salt in the water here for the pasta. And we're gonna put in some olive oil in the water. And the reason why we do that is so that the pasta won't stick to the bottom of the of the pot or won't even stick together. Because oil doesn't make pasta stick in the water. So I'll be back when the water is on the boil. So this is coming to the boil, it's slowly bubbling away as I'm waiting for my water here to <coughs> get hot so we can put in the pasta. Now I'm gonna put the pasta in a little box, take it out of the bag, put it in a box and uh, once the water is boiling we put the pasta in here. Easy to store in a plastic box like that. Better than in a plastic bag and like I said you can store it way easier. Okay, the pot over there is on the boil. We're going to take the lid off and we are going to add in the pasta here. And only the amount that you want to eat, so let's put the pasta in. So that was four hands full of pasta in the pot here and we are going to let that boil and I'll be back when we are going to be plating up my dinner. So see you in a bit. Oh and when we are going to be plating, I will be plating my dinner uh, in a separate video. Oh, I have to turn the water down. Get it off the flame here before it starts boiling over. I'm gonna have to turn it down. I'm gonna turn it down to six. Put it back on. That was close. So I'll uh, end the video here then. And we will see you in part two where we are going to be plating eating in the living room and chatting as well while i am eating so i hope you have liked this part of the video it belongs to part two like i said going to be a separate video later on when i'm eating and we are going to be chatting a little bit so let me know what you think and we will see you in part two bye bye